Okay, I want to demo how to do three things in Eclipse. Adding a JRE, setting the default JRE for a workspace, and creating a new project. All right, so let's get Eclipse going. And I'm starting with a, with an empty workspace. Your workspace will have things in it. So the first thing we want to do is add a JRE. Open the window menu. Go to preferences. Expand Java. Click on install JREs. And we're going to start a search. Up here, we need to uh, climb in the directory hierarchy a bit. So click on that left arrow. Choose the disk. Okay, so we want to find the user folder, then the lib folder, then JVM. There it is. Okay, we're using Java 8, it's a little bit confusing, 1.8 is the same as 8, so it doesn't really matter which one you select, I'll just select 1.8, and then select JRE, just like that, come down here, click open, okay, it found it, so Check that one. Okay, then click Apply and Close. Okay, then go back to Preferences. Click on Java. Oops, I'm sorry. Java Compiler. And set the compliance level to... 1.8, which is Java 8. Click Apply and Close. Okay, let's create a new Java project. So if I click on this down arrow with New, I can select Java Project. Give it a name. Let's say Mud. Make sure, right, if you did the, the previous two steps correctly, this will say Java SE 1.8. Uh, if it doesn't, you may have done something wrong. You may want to uh, redo the previous two steps. And finish. Okay, so we have a Java project with no class files in it. Right, so to add class files, and click New Class. Okay, give the class a name, say MUD. This will be the main class, so we'll put uh, the main method in it. You should only do this once per project. If you have multiple main methods, uh, when you run your program, uh, one of them will be selected at random, and you, you really want to avoid that. And then finish. <clears throat> and there you have it. Okay, right, so to create another class, let's name this another class. Okay, this time I'm not checking add a main method we can do that okay that should be everything you need to uh, add a JRE set the default JRE and create a new project